All right, test riding the X, the Yamaha X SR900. It is a naked bike, uh, much like the F09, except it's retro style. Basically, that's it. That's that's basically the difference. It's a 847 cc engine, I believe. By the way, this is going to be the first of hopefully more test ride videos. As as time goes, more test ride videos. But yeah, this will be the first of you know hopefully many more to come. I think it's nice. This is actually one of the one of my considerations for. If I was to trade in the Vulcan S, I do want to get a naked bike because performance-wise, and but street ability are just key on. They're just great on naked bikes. This is one of my top choices. Go on a test ride with Bryce and one other person. Yes. <laughs> ah, look at that dash. Well, I'm kind of short for this bike too. I'm definitely tiptoeing to this bike. But look at that dash. Gear indicator up there. That's kind of cool. See, it kind of has like a retro style, but it's with modern tech. That's the goal with these modern retro bikes. Retro styling, but with modern tech. Well, let's fix the mirrors a little bit. Woo, all right. Yeah, I'm definitely kind of short for this bike. Woo. Nice low end torque, as expected. Nice easy shifter. Definitely feeling the the wind on me, but I mean it's nothing different from my my Vulcan S. It's expected. Uh, its leanability is is okay from what I can tell. gear pull Woo. definitely got some pull that's for sure it's not fast it's not really fast but it'll get up there and go Yeah, on those lower gears, on the lower RPM spectrum, damn, this thing pulls. I really like the paint job on this particular one too. It's like a brushed aluminum look. That's awesome. Uh, flickability is all right. It could be that I'm just not used to the sitting position or this type of bike, but I mean, not too shabby. Let's lean a little bit. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah, swing it. Swing at it. I really like the dash on this. It's very uh, clear. I like the black background with the white numbers and letters. I like that. It, I, but I think the off-center nature of it might might bug some people. 
but hey, you know, that's personal preference. These beers are okay at best. I'm 5'7". Uh, I don't have long legs, but my legs are actually not that bad, or not that, uh... Okay, we pull it? Alright. Well, my legs actually aren't that very, uh, cramped on this thing. Which is nice. I mean, I don't know how that will translate for a taller person. Matter of fact, this is probably more suited for a taller person. Sure. Uh, cracks on a Pro 2 setup to set it all. Have the crack, get the ski mask treatment, I kill it all. I forgot him, see, thanking me, Jesus, I come across, get crucified by euphemisms and metaphors. Ain't no antidote for anecdotes, poisonous bars, or acid fat spilt on your pigment and melted off. Cuban licks from that Ray Kwan album, that's what I floss. If you ain't good for that, uh, I'll snatch it right off of your neck.